Today we're talking 450 Bushmaster. 250 grain bullets I'm able to find in my area. Right about now the mic dies. Um, it's a 450 Bushmaster 250 grain bullet. So you kind of get an idea of the size. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Eric here. So one of my more recent purchases is a BC-15 Bear Creek Arsenal 15 chambered in 450 Bushmaster. So the rifle's right here. It's got a 1 in 24 twist, which is kind of the standard for Bushmaster. Um, I am told there are some barrels that are chambered in 1 in 16, a little faster rate, but not so successful. So it's probably more of a, a match grade ammo that's you know specific to the um, manufacturer of the ammo. Uh, they probably match grade the bullet to that charge to that uh, 1 in 16 twist. This is 18 inch Parkernized heavy barrel 1 in 24 twist. Um, I was just looking on their website. They have gone up a little bit, about 30 bucks. I paid about $229.99 for mine uh, back in September. They're now running about $265, so a little over 30 bucks more. But uh, I've gone out and shot a couple rounds, and in this platform, I mean, it gives you a little bit of a kick, which is, you know, kind of fun. It's, it's I'd say it's comparable to 308 as far as kick is recoil is concerned, uh, except for in the AR platform, you usually don't have good buttstocks to kind of negate that. I went through, loaded this one up. It's on a Bear Creek Arsenal um, lower as well. Um, it, this upper does fit my Aero Precision binary trigger upper. I just haven't been uh, <laughs> wanting to punish myself with that shoulder breaker uh, firing multiple rounds that quickly with it. Um, it does fit. It, in theory, would work. It would rapid fire 450 bush, but I wouldn't recommend it. I mean, it's... These things are still 37 to 40 some bucks a box. They're, they're almost two bucks a round compared to 762 or 556, which you can get for 67 to 65 bucks or 67 to 65 cents a round. So 450 Bush is, you know, a straight wall cartridge, 45 caliber, good for up to 200 yards before it starts to really drop off, is what I'm reading. So. Technically, if you wanted to hunt with an AR-15, Bear Creek Arsenal, BC-15, chambered in 450. You'll see they also have a couple other different offerings in that. I will say, as my last Bear Creek Arsenal review, it is a heavier gun. I mean, if I had to guess, I'm going to say six, seven pounds, maybe seven and a half pounds. But when you're shooting... A bigger round like 308 or 450 Bushmaster. Kind of nice to have some of that recoil taken up with a little extra weight. Um, like I said, you can hunt with this round deer, elk. Um, you know, up to about a, you know, safely what I've read, it looks like it's about 150 yards. Uh, it will go too, but it'll start dropping more. Um, and some sites will say it'll go 250 before it starts dropping. I'd be willing to bet you at 150, this is probably a very accurate, great hunting rifle. I have yet to try it for hunting. Um, it's one of my goals for this year is to do a little deer and elk hunting. Um, that's all I have for you now, guys. Hey, I appreciate you watching as usual. Love you all. Peace out.